Leaving Hamburg, one of a small, small select group of clubs still looking for that first victory of the season. Jurgen Rober has to be delighted. His club had a tough week and in a tough first half as well today. But they came strong in the second half and Jurgen Rober pulled all the right strings as the emotional leader of Wolfsburg pumping up the troops in celebration. Let's take a look at the highlights and what a great second half it was entertaining throughout. We begin the first half action, Benny Manavikia. Great ball in. No problem at all for Simon Yentz. More from Hamburg. Confusion in the box. Beinlich gets hold of the loose ball and rips the shot just wide. And then minute 13, Nahido Takahara slips in behind the fence. Well, that was the best chance of the half for Hamburg. And he wasted it. Meanwhile, Wolfsburg trying to get on the score sheet. Pigenhagen on the save from Street. And then another great opportunity, Topic, but he missed fire. So Wolfsburg had some good opportunities, but they were scoreless, as was Hamburg. But that would change in minute 47 with Sergey Barbarez, his first goal of the season. And it was 1-0. Great ball in by Raphael Vicky. Give him the assist, give Barbarez the goal. The 55th of his career. But then in minute 49, Klimovitz answers. Petrov set it up nicely. And it'll be one all. Great ball by Petrov. Klimovitz, good first time finish. Petrov takes matters into his own hands at the hour mark. Great run, makes it 2-1. Fantastic run started in his own half, and he capped it off in style with the goal. Then in minute 70, D'Alessandro swings in Muller, who fires home through the legs of Hagen. 3-1, and Wolfsburg were on their way. Muller's first league goal of the season, his first in a couple of years. But Wolfsburg was just getting started. 15 minutes left, D'Alessandro, oh, he's breaking angles. His first Bundesliga goal, a goal and assist for the tiny Argentine. He was a man amongst boys at times in the second half. Then in minute 85, Klimovitz makes it twice as nice. He closes the scoring. His second goal of the match, third of the season, as Wolfsburg throttle Hamburg 5-1 at the Volkswagen. We take a look at the final stats. Look at Wolfsburg, five goals on 15 shots. They'll take that all day. Four saves for Simon Yentz, who allowed just one goal. Seven for Piekenhagen, who's had better days. Each team ended up with three yellow cards apiece from our referee, Mr. Herbert Fondel. So Hamburg limp into round four. As we take a look at round four fixtures, Bremen Schalke should be an outstanding contest. Bochum taking on the leaders, Leverkusen, Stuttgart, Kondersaden, and Borussia Dortmund hit the road to take on Cologne. Remember, this is the last round of action for two weeks of all these teams looking to head into that break with some momentum. Frankfurt, the new boys, welcoming Hertha Berlin, still winless on the campaign, as is Hamburg, who have a tough match against Bayern Munich, and a special midweek match to follow. Hanover taking on Hansa Rostock as round four will take place over the next week and a half and then we'll be down for a couple weeks and that's why it's so important for the momentum to be built before the layoff. Jurgen Robert jumping for joy as Wolfsburg beat Hamburg by a final score of 5-1 for the entire crew. I've been your old sound hop we thank you so much for watching the 40th German Bundesliga season on the one and only home of world-class soccer, Fox Sports World.